Welcome back to Passionate About Tech. Today, we're diving into the best method to install or update your Intel HD graphics driver on Windows 10 and Windows 11. Whether you're a gamer, a video editor, or just want crystal clear visuals, this step-by-step -step guide will have your system running smoothly in no time. Ready to get started? Let's do this. The easiest and most reliable way to update your Intel HD graphics driver is by using the Intel Driver and Support Assistant. This free tool automatically detects your hardware and finds the right driver for you. First, open your web browser. I'll be using Google Chrome, but you can use any browser you prefer, like Firefox or Edge. In the address bar, type www.intel.com and press Enter. Once you're on Intel's website, look for the search bar at the top. Type Intel Driver and Support Assistant and hit Enter. The first result should be a page titled Intel Driver and Support Assistant. Click on that link. On this page, you'll see a big blue button that says Download Now. Click it to start downloading the tool. Once the download is complete, find the file in your Downloads folder and double-click it to start the installation. The installer will pop up. Follow the prompts, accept the terms and conditions. You'll be asked if you want to join Intel's improvement program. I recommend clicking Decline to skip this, but it's up to you. This might take a minute or two, so be patient. Once it's done, click Launch to open the Intel driver and Support Assistant. The tool will open in your default browser. It'll automatically scan your system to identify your hardware including your Intel HD graphics model. For example, my machine has an Intel HD graphics 620, but yours might be different, like an Intel HD graphics 5300 or 4000. If it finds a driver update, you'll see a list of available updates. Look for the one labeled graphics driver and click download next to it. Follow the on-screen instructions to install the driver, then restart your computer when prompted. Now, if the Intel driver and support assistant doesn't find any updates, or if you prefer more control, you can install the driver manually. This is a great option if you want to ensure you're getting the exact driver for your system. First, let's identify your processor and graphics model. Right-click the Start button at the bottom left of your screen and select System. This opens the System Information window. Look under Processor to find your Intel processor details, like Intel Core 1-5-7500 or similar. Note the generation, for example, a number like 7 means 7th generation. This helps you find the right driver. Next, go back to your browser and return to www.intel.com. In the search bar, type Intel HD Graphics Drivers and press Enter. Click on the result that says List of Drivers for Intel Graphics, or something similar. On this page, scroll down to find the Intel Download Center. Here, you can search for your specific graphics model. If you know your model, like Intel HD Graphics 6100, type that in. If not, use your processor generation, like 7th Gen Intel Core processors. Select your operating system, Windows 10 or Windows 11, from the drop-down menu. Choose the latest one for your system. Once you've selected the right driver, click Download. After the download finishes, find the file in your Downloads folder and double-click it to run the installer. The Intel Graphics Driver Setup Wizard will open. Click Begin Installation. And I agree to agree to the terms. Leave the settings on default or Check Option saying Execute a clean installation and click Start. The installation will take a few minutes. Once it's done, you'll see a prompt to restart your computer. Select it to reboot your computer. After your computer restarts, let's verify the driver installed correctly. Right-click the Start button and select Device Manager. Expand the Display Adapters section by clicking the arrow next to it. You should see your Intel HD graphics listed without any yellow triangles or exclamation marks. Right-click it, select Properties, and go to the Driver tab. 
check the driver version and driver date to confirm it's the latest version you downloaded. Here's a pro tip. If you're having issues, like the driver not installing or Windows reverting to an older version, try disconnecting from the internet before installing. This prevents Windows from automatically overriding your driver with an older one. Another tip, create a system restore point before updating your driver. This is a safety net in case something goes wrong. To do this, type create a restore point in the Windows search bar and press enter. In the System Properties window, click Create, name your restore point, and click Create again. This takes a minute and gives you peace of mind. If you're loving these tech tips and want more, hit that subscribe button to join the passionate about tech community. To recap, we covered two methods. The automatic Intel driver and support assistant for a hassle-free update, and the manual method for more control. Both will keep your Intel HD graphics running at peak performance. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Stay passionate about tech.